Denny Avdia is very capable. He's very skilled. He can handle the ball as a 6'9 forward. He can shoot it as a 6'9 forward, as he's shown. Um, his instincts are very good. He just makes the right plays. Give the ball to Denny Avdia some more and let him shine. Really quick, before I begin, if you guys can smash the like button for the YouTube algorithm, this seriously makes a huge difference to my videos and lets YouTube know to recommend this video to a brand new audience. So thank you so much for doing that and let's begin. So let's talk about Denny Avdia. He had a mini breakout against the Orlando Magic. 16 points, he made 6 of his 10 shot attempts, 4 made 3s, he had the highest plus minus on the team with a plus 19. Denny Avdia needed this bad, he needed it desperately, he took 10 shots. After the game, Bradley Beal said that Russell Westbrook yells at Denny when he doesn't shoot. Um, when you watch him play on the court, it looks like he often defers to Russell Westbrook. Russell Westbrook often asks for the ball, especially when they're bringing the ball up the floor. But I digress there. It looks good. It looks good. Look, Denny Avdia looks good when he shoots. It's, it's sometimes that simple. For a player to look like they're a capable player, it requires them shooting the ball. And I know that's boiling it down to its simplest terms, but really for Denny Avdia, that's what it is. He's a player who is very capable. He's very skilled. The Wizards drafted him ninth overall for that reason. He was a projected top five pick for that reason. He can handle the ball as a 6'9 forward. He can shoot it as a 6'9 forward as he's shown. Um, his instincts are very good. He just makes the right plays. He showed that he can contribute early in the season and then the Wizards stopped going to Denny Avdia and kind of slotted him as a spot-up shooter, which he was never projected to be. But he showed that he can knock down shots. He made four threes on Wednesday, but more importantly, again, 10 shot attempts. The season for the Wizards probably won't result in a playoff spot. Obviously, he won't be contending. So what is the goal here if you're the Wizards? The goal is to make sure the likes of Denny Avdia and Rui Hachimura, who also made his return on Wednesday, had a bit of a rough game, but guess what? He hasn't played in a while, and, and Rui had some good games prior to his injury, but if you're the Washington Wizards, the goal is to make sure Denny and Rui are continuing to develop, and that they're continuing to show that they can contribute at a high level. Maybe not this year immediately, but next year and the years after, because the Wizards need building blocks. Rui and Denny have shown flashes of being that. Denny's obviously still very young, hasn't even finished his first season in the league, but 16 points. Uh, and, and he looked good doing it. He looked assertive. He looked confident. And when Denny Avdia is playing with confidence, he's a very good young player. He's an asset to the team. And the Wizards need to keep going to him. Because like I said, the season is about developing these young players, especially at this point in the season when the Wizards really aren't competing for much. Wizards need to make sure they're getting the most out of Denny Avdia because he is really full of talent. He's one of those players where he oozes talent. He's not hyper-athletic. He's not going to make big-time flashy plays, but he makes key plays. He sets good screens. He He's a very good pick-and-roll ball handler for a player his size, and he's shown that he can shoot it a little bit from the outside too, so the Wizards need to let him do that more often. Give the ball to Denny Avdia some more and let him shine. <laughs> 